This session is called Nuts About Nature. It's going to be really busy doing lots of lovely things. I'm going to do some bark rubbing. All you need is some crayons and some paper. We're going to be doing some mud painting. All you need is a cup, a brush and some water. And then we're going to do some natural art. All you need is everything outdoors and your imagination. Right then, so we're going to do a bark rubbing. A bark rubbing is a brilliant way of taking a memory of your tree. There's so many different trees about. Every tree has a different bark, a different texture. And to do it, all you need, like I said, is a piece of paper and a crayon. So I've got a box of crayons here. All you need to do is select your favourite colour. Mine's red. And you find your tree, your paper against it, get your crayon, the side of your crayon, and then you rub up and down. And as you can see, it takes on the texture of your tree bark. To make it a bit fancier, you can choose a different colour. Move it slightly and go on top. You can also use a leaf. So you put your paper on top of your leaf and then you rub and the texture of the leaf comes through. It's a brilliant one to do in the autumn. It works all year round too. Right then, we're going to make some mud paint. This is super easy and it's really good fun. And you know what? Get your grown-ups involved because this is one of my favourite things to join in with on a school trip, on a nature talk session, because it just makes you really chill out and enjoy being outside. So all you do is collect yourself some mud in there, in a cup, use a yoghurt pot if you don't want to use your plastic cups. Do whatever you want. Bit of mud bit of water, get yourself a super duper mixing stick and then you mix it all in like that and then you need to find yourself a canvas. So please don't do it on anything uh, <laughs> your parents might not enjoy, on your dad's car, not a good idea, but find yourself a nice tree. As you can see, it's nice and pale and all you do, you get your paint and you start painting. You can also paint a face on a log. Right then, so we're going to do some natural art. I always like to have a nice photo frame made out of sticks. And then I get another stick and I clear the area. And now I've got my very own blank canvas. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to collect some natural material from all around and I'm going to make my very own art picture. I've got no glue, I've got no paper, no glitter. I'm going to make it all out of natural material. Everything I pick up is fallen naturally. I don't pick anything off of the trees. You really don't need to, there's plenty on the ground. Just watch out for any prickles and obviously watch out for any fungus. But if you're not picking, it's not an issue anyway. Right, I've collected all my things and I'm gonna make my picture. There we go. You guess what it is? 